Hello, welcome to St. Mary's Catholic Parish. I'm Father Martin, the pastor here. Welcome to the center here at St. Mary's Church. Brothers and sisters, a lot of changes have been going on over the last couple of months. A lot of new faces have appeared and some of our other faces have gone. Um, Cindy Johnson has retired and so there was a need to uh, fill a spot here at the church and we did just that. There's a wonderful person, Shannon Hansen, has come in to fill that position. She's done a wonderful job. So we thought we'd take the opportunity to take this time to introduce you to her. So that way when you call and you hear a different voice, you know whose voice it is. Or when you walk into the parish center and you see her standing, they're sitting at her desk, you'll know who she is. Brothers and sisters, she's been a big help for us over the last two weeks that she has been here. And I know she's going to fit right in with our church family. And so, brothers and sisters, I'd like to take this time to introduce you to our new church secretary and good friend, Shannon Hansen. Fancy, you want to call on line three. Thank you. Hey, Shannon, it's Father Martin. How are you? I'm great. How are you? Welcome. Well, hey, Shannon, well, I'm glad that you are here. Glad that you joined our team here at St. Mary's Parish. It's so good to have you here. Thank you. I'm honored to be here. Shannon, you know, a couple of things, you know, we're in this COVID situation where not everybody can come into the church or the parish. And so a lot of changes have happened. And so we want to get our, our people, our people here at St. Mary's to get to know you. And as well as our brothers and sisters at in our parish in Whitesboro to get to know who you are. Right. So we thought we'd take this time to ask you a couple of questions to, so they can get to know you. So when they make that phone call or they walk into the church, they know exactly who they're dealing with. Putting a name with a face. Absolutely okay. put a name with a face. Yeah. So you got just a few seconds? You bet. All right, great. So tell us a little bit, who are you? Uh, my name is Shannon Henson yeah. and I'm from Anna, Texas. And um, I have five kids. I'm married. My husband's name is Dave Henson. And um, all of our children are boys. I've got two that are going to school at St. Mary's. Awesome. And how is it that you come here to St. Mary's? So, like I said, I have two sons at St. Mary's. One, a third son that already graduated from St. Mary's. So when I found out that this position was available, I thought... It would be a great way for me to spend more time with the boys and be more involved um, with the parish, not just the school. Well, cool. Great. That's awesome. Okay, so let's go a little bit more personal. Okay. Oh, oh here we go. <laughs> do you have any hobbies? I do. Um, I've recently started to garden um, container beds. I don't have um, fruits or vegetables. It's, it's flowers. And what kind of flowers are you growing? Um, I love to grow hydrangeas. They're my favorite flower. Is there a specific color that you like? I love blue the most, but they don't stay blue. They keep turning pink. Um, but I have some white ones too. And mm -hmm. Nice. What about your favorite color? Green is my favorite color. I love all shades of green. Um, Why? Because green is happy. Um, it's life-giving. And... Um, I love all colors, but green just makes me happy. It's cheerful. That's awesome. That's fantastic. What about, uh, let's see, do you have a favorite pet? I do. I have a favorite pet. Her name is Noelle. She's a golden doodle, um, labradoodle, sorry. She's, um, she's actually Father Martin's dog that we get to dog sit, but we love her. Oh, that's sweet. Yes. Yeah. Noelle is very single and very looking. No, I'm just That's terrible. Uh, okay, let's talk about music. Is there a favorite genre of music that you like? Christian music. Is there a group or a singer that you really follow? Matt Marr is my favorite. Mm -hmm. And um, I've recently started to listen to a lot of Dave and Lauren Moore, who are some local artists who yeah. you may have seen do our praise and worship here. Yeah. And they're also doing um, the Masses with the Diocese. Right, yeah, Sometimes. they're a great couple, yeah. beautiful voices, beautiful. absolutely, beautiful. It's a great heart. What about food? Is there a specific food that you like? I love Italian food. What in, what in particular about Italian? 
So my grandmother was from Italy, and so um, she was a great cook and just makes me think of her. Nice. Is lasagna there... is my favorite. Greasy lasagna. Greasy, Greasy lasagna. lasagna. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. I've got to try that. Okay. Yeah. Well, what do you have any, if we're talking about foods, do you have a food allergy? I do. Uh -oh. I have gluten, dairy, and soy. So how is it possible that you have Italian food, right? You're just going to have to risk it. So, awesome question because I love lasagna, but you can make lasagna instead of the noodles. with Instead of pasta, you can do zucchini and squash, and it's so good. Believe me, it's great. Okay, we'll trust you on that mm -hmm. one. Yeah. So let's talk about Bibles. Um, is there a specific Bible or do you have a favorite Bible verse? So I would say for me that changes with the seasons in my life. Um, right now I'm drawn to Proverbs. Um, Train up a child in the way he should and when he grows he will not depart from it. Because I've got five boys and various um, ages of their lives and... Two of them are out of the house, no longer under our control. So um, with with that, there's another scripture verse that I tend to fall on. That's um, trust in the Lord with all your heart. And lean not on your own understanding in all your ways. Acknowledge him and he will direct your paths. Oh, those are beautiful Bible verses. And thank you for sharing with that personal yeah. part. Yeah. So um, how do you pray? My favorite way to pray is in adoration because it's quiet time. It's me time just with the Lord, without distractions, um, without people interrupting me. Nice. Yeah, yeah. I love adoration as well. Yeah, it's, me too. It's a special time to spend with the Lord. Mm -hmm. Talk about um, special times. If you could go back in time, any time at all, who would you like to meet? So the obvious would probably be Jesus, but I also have a strong devotion to Mary, as you can see. I have, um, I feel like I know her pretty well. She's guided me throughout my journey um, in life. So I would probably like to get to know St. Joseph more and kind of understand his why and who he is and how it was for someone who... Um, you know, was, was like us, not born free of sin, and how he was able to just, what, give his yes to everything. Yeah, obviously, yeah, that's just beautiful. Getting to know somebody's fiat, and how do we choose to say yes to Christ in the face mm -hmm. of temptation, that's beautiful. What a, that's a great person to meet, yeah. I, would, I think I'd, somebody that I would like to meet. Okay, brothers and sisters, well, we had a great time, and we, I know you're busy, and you've got a lot of stuff going on. Um, we just wanted to take a, just a few minutes out of your time, out of this day, to, to welcome you, first and foremost, to Thank our you. parish and, and to our staff and to our f little family that we have here. And, um, and I pray that, you know, all of our brothers and sisters who are members here with us will welcome you and just embrace you just as we have. And I know once they get to meet you, you're going to have a lot of little fans around. Mm -hmm. So that's awesome. Thank Shannon, you. thank you for joining the team. Thank you for being spending a few minutes getting to know you and, and talking about your life. We pray and hope that God will continue to guard you and your family each and every day. Thank you very much. I'm God, excited to meet everyone. God bless.